So essentially, I can use Facebook Marketing API to, um, let's say, review thousands of interests that are hidden in Facebook Ads Manager without really needing to dig deep into the, you know, the code. So um, Facebook Ads Manager can give me um, 25 interest su suggestion to target and um, but it's usually not good to rely on these because we will run into a lot of competitors it's better to identify a niche um, so research like the Facebook audience insights via Google um, and then interest that cannot be targeted using Facebook ads alone so using the Facebook marketing API I can review the interest suggestion that the ads manager hides, but I can use this to target. So um, a lot of people now use um, Facebook ads to highly specific target um, certain niche audience and reach massive scale winning campaigns. So the downside of this popularity of the platform like Facebook for advertising is that um, they have hidden a lot of specific interests that they know that you can target from your suggestion groups. Um, so then you also are competing with other people from the same industry as you. So you need to know exactly what the suggestions are that are also different from the ones that other advertisers are using. So this way you can get them by having a massive bidding war and more and more Facebook ads are more expensive. And in my experience, um, paid social ranges from 100 to $200 for a sign up, sign up and that is incredibly expensive compared to um, paid search. So we need to figure out like what the hidden interests of them are um, through Facebook marketing API. So what that means is that we need to get like a backdoor to retrieve these information via the API. So let's say you have like a, create like an app, then request an access token. So then I can get the app token. Then I need to do like a I'll use a ad interest method. This way I can create campaigns, set budgets and targeting um, with two methods of the targeting functionality of the API. Um, and then I can use the API in order to